Hello there and welcome to the series of videos that's going through A-level maths content in the first year. Here we're looking at parallel lines in particular, exercise 5e, and here um, we're going to go through a question on parallel lines. So just a little reminder about parallel lines, maybe you've seen this before. If two lines are parallel, such as these two lines here, then in the equation of those lines, the gradient must be equal to x plus 2 this might be. So the 3 and the 2 just correspond to where they meet on the y-axis so they can be different if the lines are parallel however it must go up at the same rate or go down at the same rate um, and the indication of that happening is that the gradient is equal. So here for this video here the real key important point here is gradients are equal. Okay, so we're going to use this fact inside a question um, here. So the question here is, a line is parallel to the line 6x plus 3y minus 2 equals 0 and passes through the coordinate 3, 5. Find the equation of the line. So what we need to do first is probably rearrange this formula here so that we know what the gradient of this line is going to be. So take the equation of your line and rearrange it into y equals mx plus c so we can really clearly see what the gradient is. Add the 2 and take away the 6x, divide through by the 3 and you get 2 thirds minus 2x. Now I've written it the other way around here, the gradient here is always the value in front of x, so the gradient here is negative 2. So what I've got here now is now a question where I've got a gradient of minus 2 and it intersects a certain point. And in the previous video we saw how to deal with questions like that. What we now need to do is just plug these values into y equals mx plus c. Uh, x is the value 3, y is the value 5, m is the gradient minus 2 because the gradients are going to be equal if the two lines are parallel. So we then plug in the values, work out what the value c needs to be, and then rewrite out your equation again with that value of c. So y here is going to equal minus 2 plus 11x. Okay, so key point for this video, gradient is equal if your two lines are parallel. You don't know what the y-intercept is, so you have to do a little bit of calculation to work that one out and you have to just insert the coordinates of 3, 5, treating these as x and y values, um, and work out the value c. The final answer always is to rewrite out your answer um, with a y equals mx plus c form. All right then, so a quick video of this one. Pause this one and have a go at the question. Okay, hopefully that didn't take you too long, maybe even the time of uh, me pausing there. So, um, we have the equation of y equals 5x plus 8. And a parallel line to this is going to be any line with y equals 5x. Uh, we, can, we can have plus anything at the end there, as long as it has the 5x as its gradient. We also know it crosses the coordinate 0, 3. So 0, 3 appearing here. So what we can do here is plug in the coordinate 0, 3. And we get C is the value 3. And that makes sense because it crosses the y-axis and it's the y-intercept. So the equation of this line here is y equals 5x plus 3. And it's going to look something like that. Okay, thanks very much for watching. Have a lot of practice at this type of question here. Persevere through the difficult ones and ask your teacher to help if you need it. Thanks for watching.